the NFL to Hollywood to fatherhood. Join me as I tackle my next journey in life, becoming Hollywood's next action star. Right, here we go, baby. Arm day, Friday. Getting after it, four movements. We're gonna do a barbell curl, weighted dips, easy bar, uh, close grip bench, and uh, incline dumbbell curls. So I got a little bit of time right now. I gotta go do an ADR session, which is like just voiceover for uh, an episode I already shot on uh, a kid's show called The Really Loud House. Uh, I gotta go hop in my closet after this, get soundproofed, and uh, mic it up and get, get after it. But before I do that, I'm gonna get after these weights. Here we go. Start off on this barbell curl. <clears throat> this is 115 pounds, I'm already warmed up. Ha! Woo! Hmm. Ah. Ah. buddy so I really like the idea of doing compound movements to build the triceps obviously I know my chest is involved in both the weighted dips and the easy bar close grip bench however I've really pulled back on the volume on my chest so I'm not worried about that um, but from my experience the best way to build muscle is to really load up uh, a movement and you can't do that any better than a compound movement uh, you can sit around and do some lighter isolations all day, but it just calls more out of your body to get under some weight on a compound movement. And so that's the theory for right now. It may change, but we're going to keep getting after it. Woo! This is 115 pounds. Yeah, same as my barbells curls, actually. I didn't even think about that. Here we go. Half my body weight. Cool. Ah. <laughs> Not bad, lost one rep, eight to seven. Three minute break or so. Ah, much bigger drop off on that one. I had a weird rep where I kind of lost my groove and uh, killed the momentum for the rest of the set. Took a lot of energy to gain the balance back. Either way, stimulus, check. Before I head into my next arm superset, I'm gonna dust off these lateral delts real quick. Uh, again, this, pretty much everything beyond my arms, calves, and neck are in a maintenance phase, so even, even the shoulders. So I'm just gonna touch them couple times a week, tell them, hey, we still need you. We still got to use you. Here's a little stimulus. Don't lose muscle. But I don't want to overdo them and every other muscle group and think I can just keep infinitely adding volume to the areas I want to grow because your central nervous system only has so much uh, to give each week. So, uh. whew. Take a few seconds off, get that intense burnout, and then pick them right back up. And I stay in that failure mode for three more sets of five. 
Next superset, easy bar, close grip bench with, uh, I'm just gonna move the bench up, incline dumbbell curls for that deep stretch. 215 pounds, 30 pound dumbbells. Makes it forces me to go slower. <laughs> Here we go. <sighs> All right, one more of those, and we're finitoed. Ah, so I'm loving the idea of using heavy compound movements to grow the triceps. I know my chest is involved a little bit on the easy bar, close grip, and the dips, but I'm feeling it in my triceps, especially on this one. And I just think, obviously everybody knows compound movements are the best way to not only get stronger and build muscle, but to track your strength. Um, it's hard if you're just doing a bunch of lighter isolation movements to build the muscle. For me anyways, it's a lot harder to track if I'm actually getting stronger from session to session or if I just went 0.2 seconds faster per rep and was able to squeeze one extra out before I you know, failed in the lactic acid buildup. Um, manager just text me, let me see something real quick. Make sure to, just letting you know your fudge. Okay. Please hold pin dates from a manager. Morning from casting. Please hold pin dates. We will know more early next week. I have a good feeling. Have a good weekend and hug those kiddos. So this is for uh, new action comedy uh, that you're making. It just had a big thing in deadline yesterday that it's going to have a 2025 release date. Um, hopefully I kept most of the footage. Um, from my previous auditions and my process on that so that I can make a little documentary video uh, leading into the film and throughout the film and drop that for y'all. Um, so this is exactly what this whole series is about, is this, this role right here checks every single box of everything I'm trying to do in Hollywood. The reason I got in for big laughs, for big entertainment, big action, big levity, you know, combining and merging the things that make you happiest. Big action, big smiles and laughs. So this, this character would definitely be that. Uh, so I'm throwing up a prayer right now. Lord Jesus, please give me this one. Amen. All right, again, I think compound movements are gonna be the key to me building these triceps more so than the isolations. Um, I also find that a rep range of, you know, five to 10 and more specifically five to eight where I'm really loading up the weight a little more is the best for growth for me. I also get the best pumps that way. <clears throat> Here we go. I thought this was gonna be a movement that I get six to eight, and the first one I got 11, so we'll see what happens here. Ooh. 
All right. I'm going to move this out because that was awful last time hitting the rack. Last game of the year. Can't hold anything back now. We know, Dan. We know. <laughs> Name that movie. Oh. right there. That's it, y'all. One step closer every day. Whether this one works or not, this movie, we're one step closer today because I put it in. Go put it in towards your goals, whatever those look like. And every time you do that, it's a good day. Everything else is a cherry on top. I also find that I'm more productive in everything else when I check the biggest thing off the list at the top of the day. It makes the whole thing feel like a win, and that gives me extra motivation and energy to give more of myself in other areas. Love y'all. God bless you.